This is the dissection of the endocrine system, and this is a male rat. So I'm going to cover one, two, three, four, five different endocrine glands. Starting up here with the, here's the trachea. This is not a gland, but that's a windpipe. And then way at the top, way up here by the cranial end of the trachea, you can see a little swelling and some white dots. Well, that swelling is the larynx, the voice box, and the little white dots that you'll see there, that one right there, I think you can see, let's see, right there, I believe, right there. Anyway, that thing is the, uh, is the thyroid gland. So the thyroid gland kind of wraps around the trachea right here. And basically anything, if we point at something way up here at the top of this trachea, uh, at, in this section, it'll be the uh, thyroid gland. Now, the parathyroid glands are embedded in there, but you can't see them. This is the thymus, and it's a big sort of lobe uh, gland that lies right on top of the heart. So anything, here's the heart, anything that you'll see kind of flopped over the heart like this is the thymus. And the functions of all those will be covered in a later video, and plus you have it in your book. So now I'm just going to point out some landmarks here. Here's the liver. That's not a gland. I mean, not an endocrine gland. Here's this big strap-like thing called the spleen, which helps functions in your... Uh, your uh, immune system. And then if I go look underneath here, I'm gonna flip up the liver and flip up the spleen, and I'm gonna see a mass of tissue. Now, I'll just give you another landmark. This is the stomach right there, the tip of my pointer, right there. Okay, so that's the stomach. Now, liver, stomach, and if I flip up this thing, you can see this kind of chewing gum stuff in there. So between the stomach, and the spleen in this kind of membrane, this membrane is called the mesentery, is this, they call it a diffuse organ, and it's kind of spread out. And it looks kind of like, to me, like chewing gum. So right in here, if I can get the light, sorry. Let's see if I can get around over here. Let me get another tool. I'm gonna to use the scissors to point. Okay, so right there, that's the pancreas. All right, the pancreas, uh, functions in digestion, but also in your endocrine system in the production of uh, insulin and glucagon. All right, moving on. Now I'm gonna move to the right kidney over here just because it's closer to the camera, but I'm flipping up some more liver here and moving the stuff out of the way. So here's a kidney, uh, but at the top of the kidney is what I'm trying to look at. Right here at the cranial end of the kidney, you see this little white dot, another little white lump. Okay, that is your adrenal gland, or the, the rat's adrenal gland, right? So the adrenal glands right there, and that produces a number of hormones, which again will be detailed in a later video, and what you have in your book. <clears throat> so anything, you, any gland, any little white blob you see at the top of a kidney, adrenal gland. Now I'm going to go all the way down to the last one. See, I did thyroid, thymus, uh, pancreas, adrenal, and last, uh, this is a male rat. So I'm going to. I've already cut open the scrotum, and then inside of the scrotum is uh, one of the testes. So here, this is. This is the testis of a of the rat, and they're paired, of course, um, and should be obvious. 